Hello everyone, this is 101 and today we are going to fix Windows 10 creators update. So Microsoft recently came out with it and users have been struggling to install this update. They say they come across various errors such as not enough storage to install the update or the update simply fails. So today we are going to fix that. First of all, what you need to do is you need to copy the link into the description that says bits reset tool. Bits means background intelligent transfer service. What it does is it copies the files of the update and sends it from the server to your PC. So it is the major component of Windows update. You need to copy this link. You need to go to your browser. You need to paste it and it will download a 300 KB file just like this. You need to open that file and it will say it will fix the problems with the Windows update. It is a Microsoft tool so you can press next. It will detect the problems and fix it automatically. Next for the users who are finding the problem with the storage, you need to download a tool called CCleaner. There are many more alternatives for this software but I prefer this so I am going to recommend it. It has both the free version and a paid version. You can buy the paid version for to support the developers and uh, I prefer the free version because it works for me. Uh, here I am going to download the free version, it will take me down here, download that and as soon as the, is the, it downloads you need to install it and this is what CCleaner looks like okay it is it has all these boxes checked and they are all important what it does it it cleans out your cache it cleans out your recycle bin it cleans out all other dump, dump files and it, what you need to do is you need to run cleaner and press ok as soon as it will be finished you will have enough space to install the windows update and it should run smoothly for the last resort what you need to do is you need to delete all the installation files and uh, start again with the update. For that you need to write cmd and right click on it and then run as admin. Yes and here it is. Here is the cmd. Then what you need to do is you need to write these commands net stop wuav serve and you need to paste it on the command prompt admin i'll leave that in leave that in description so you can copy it it will stop the service the windows update service is stopping then you need to copy this and paste that too there it is and then you need to go to c drive windows software distribution i'm going to c drive windows search for software distribution all these files you need to delete them continue okay this, so that's deleted next you need to take these commands the services that we just stopped you need to start it again because that are important for the update starting and start bits okay so it started and after all these three steps you should restart your windows update you need to restart your uh, system then you need to restart your service and the update and it should run smoothly i hope this helped leave a like if you want to uh, for more video if you want more videos subscribe to my channel and thanks for watching goodbye